Guys, we have some big news in the world of Android. Are you sick and tired of Android 14? Well, if you are, great news because Android 15 beta number one is now available. This is not the same thing as the developer preview that we had for a little while. This is a true beta number one. And before I say anything else, I want to point something out to you in this blog post. If your device is already running 14 QPR3 or the 15 developer preview, you will automatically receive the over-the-air update for Android 15 Beta 1. What does this mean? Well, it means that if you want to get out of the beta channel without having to wipe, this is your stop. The time is now. What you would need to do is go to that beta screen and opt out what is then going to happen on your device at some point in the near future, you will have an update pushed to you, which will be the downgrade, okay? And it will explicitly say to you on this screen, you're going to wipe your device when you install this. You're going to ignore it. You're not going to install it. You're not going to download it. You're going to wait. At some point, and I can't really say exactly when because the timing of these things can change, I think QPR 3's stable version for Android 13 was released sometime around June, so maybe in that general ballpark. But again, at some point, that stable will be released and then it will arrive on your phone and it won't explicitly say you're going to have to wipe to install it because it will be an upgrade, not a downgrade. You'll install it, and you'll be happily off of that beta track. And if you don't believe me, it will literally tell you this. Look at this last paragraph here. If you're currently running the beta, you can opt out before applying and wait for stable release without a factory reset. Now, I'm not opting out. I am not daily driving the Pixel 8 Pro, so I am checking for updates, and there it is. It just now popped up. So I'm going to be installing this with the purpose of exploring it and then showing to you guys what is going on in Android 15, at least in this first beta. Now, of course, they're not just going to deliver all of the new features straight away. As they go through these betas, things are going to add up and stack up. And at some point, these betas are going to become stable enough that you might consider running it on your daily driver. But for now, I would advise you, don't do this. Don't install this unless it is an extra Pixel phone. And if we go back to this, you should see here, these are the eligible devices. Basically, recent Pixels. The 7, the 8, the 6, the Fold, and the Tablet are all compatible with this beta. So guys, I don't have a whole lot more to say about this at this moment. I will just say subscribe to the channel because probably tomorrow sometime I will have dove in enough to find the changes here. And I'm going to go over not just the things that are new for this beta number one, but also the things that are new for Android 15 in general. Because again, there was a developer preview that went on as well. So we're going to cover all of that stuff hopefully as soon as tomorrow. So guys, let me know if you're going to jump into that beta or not with me. I'll see you in the next one. And until next time, stay nerdy, my friends.